Hello and welcome to the final vlog of my first semester of my first year of med school. Oh my gosh! We are officially two weeks away from the final exam. Yikes! But I am super excited to have completed this phase of my medical education and I'm looking forward to moving on to the next phase and just growing as a med student and a person. And if you want to watch me suffer for two weeks, keep on watching this vlog! It's raining out, which means I get to wear my big squeaky boots. Oh yeah. Hello and good morning. Today's Tuesday. I just spent the morning doing some review at Starbucks for anatomy and I'm going to quickly run to the lab to try and look at this stuff in real life. Printing out some notes so that I have some idea of what I'm looking at. Alrighty, so this is the setup for the lab. Just a long lab coat for protection, scrubs, and these very fashionable runners. Woo! These things. Today is Friday. This week just flew by. Did not do the best job vlogging, sorry. Um, but all I've been doing is studying. Also, check out my teeny tiny cup. Mm. I'm just baking some cookies for Food Friday so that our group has some delicious snacks. Hopefully I don't burn them or anything too unfortunate happens. Oh yeah. So I'm back home. Cookies were a success, even got a compliment on my teeny tiny mug. So cute. All right, so I'm set up at home and I'm just going to review some lectures and maybe head back to class in a bit. But right now I'm just gonna hang out here. Also, I bought this new notebook and I don't know about you guys, but I get super excited about new school supplies. So I'm home, I just went to lecture, we had a lecture on the placenta, and the person giving the lecture was as obsessed, if not more obsessed with the placenta than I am about the kidney, so that was really exciting. <laughs> Anyways, I'm home, I'm gonna vacuum because it's Friday, it's chore day, and then I might take a nap, I might go for a run, I'm kind of in limbo there, but we'll see how the timing works out. Alrighty. Good morning, today is Saturday, I'm just doing a little bit of studying and the people upstairs are tuning their piano. I don't know if you can hear it. So for the past hour I've heard ding, 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 and then they go to a different key. Ding, 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 and meanwhile I'm just like... Eh. Just did a quick little at-home workout. It's currently 6.30. Um, spent most of the day at home just hanging out, working through some lectures. <sighs> so I'm gonna shower and I think I'm gonna trim my hair because it's getting a little, a little crazy. Goodbye hair. Hair basically looks the exact same. It's just a tiny, tiny bit shorter. So I've made some hot chocolate with copious amounts of whipped cream to try and make studying histology a little more palatable. Also that teeny tiny cup that I was so excited about fell on the pavement while I was walking and it broke. RIP little cup. We had a really good 24 hours. Till I dropped you. Good morning. Today is Sunday. I'm off to study a bit more. Uh, yesterday I was like pretty good till about four, and then I spent the rest of the night relaxing. Whoops. Whoops. Okay, so Starbucks was closed, even though it's eight fifteen in the morning. Ugh, that's really there was a wrench in my plans. Update, it is now dark and I am heading home. Alrighty, so I just got home from my long day. Good morning. 
Today is Monday, and it is the last Monday of first semester, first year classes. Pretty crazy. I'm up early because I need to work on my CBL. So I just did a module on breastfeeding because we are in the pregnancy week, and I did not realize this, but breastfeeding is like way better than formula. So I thought I would share that. Uh, yeah, pretty interesting. So I'm home, just had our last FOSS journal club, very happy about that, and now I'm going to work on some anatomy and histology. I'm hoping my goal is to try and get through like one lab per night. Good morning! Today is Tuesday and it is freezing cold outside. I spent the morning at Starbucks studying, but I was wearing what I'm wearing now, like a full-on winter coat, a jacket, and a hoodie. Anyways, I'm going to go for a run to try and warm up and then hopefully get back into studying. So I am currently reviewing the menstrual cycle and ovulation is pretty crazy. This giant thing, look how big that is, that is an egg. So here's the thing, I love school supplies. Oh yeah. And nothing makes me happier than the perfect pen. What? Although this pen says deluxe fine, not pleased with it. Got a beautiful gold cylinder, but fact of the matter is it is not meeting my expectations and requirements for a perfect pen. I need a pen to be smooth. Pen needs to make it fun to write. Maybe that's a load of baloney. The pen's actually mediocre, kind of fine. And I don't need a new pen, and I'm just looking for an excuse to go to the bookstore, try out their pens, and maybe buy some. That's what we're gonna do is our study break. It's very cold out, so I'm wearing the hat. morning it is friday and it is the official last day of classes for first semester what so i made more cookies because it's food friday again hello so i'm home we just had our last day of classes it's so crazy that this semester is officially over we have the afternoon off because normally in the afternoon we would start the next week but there is no next week uh because we're done the semester so yeah, anyways, I'm going to study for the afternoon, and then tomorrow we have something called our OSCE. So I got to make sure I got everything together for that. So as you know, I do not like studying for FOSS or prepping for FOSS. And it's not that I have anything against statistics and research methods, but when you're learning about pregnancy and you're watching videos about neonatal surgery and you're learning about diabetes, that is just way more interesting than developing a study design. So it's like really, really hard to motivate yourself to study for this. So we are currently attempting to motivate ourselves to study for FOSS. Come on, paper, you gotta get some writing on you. Here we are learning about p-values and standard deviation for the bazillionth time. Just finished the OSCE examination. It was really fun. It was a great way to sort of get a feel for what an OSCE is like. So for anyone who doesn't know, OSCE is the practical exam. So throughout the year, we learn how to do things like vitals, a respiratory exam, an abdominal exam, and a cardiac exam, as well as how to do a proper patient interview to gather history. So our OSCE is basically a test of that, so we have a volunteer patient, an examiner who watches, and you run through those things and verbalize what you're doing. So that's what we did today. Anyways, it's 3.30, it kind of sucks that the whole day was spent on getting there, doing that. Didn't really have time to study, so that's what I'm going to go do now. So I have very quickly transformed from my professional look 
to my look that I like to call camper chic. Eh, it's a lot comfier. I was just studying at Starbucks for a bit and oh my gosh, you guys, medicine is so cool. It, oh, it just like blows my mind how interconnected all these very complicated organ systems are and how the physiology just interacts throughout the body. Saturday night and I'm living it up. The data I collect can be one of two things. It could be categories or it could be numbers. I kid you not, this is like the truest story of my life. I'll be studying and I'll be like, I'll make flashcards, then I'll remember. Then I do like an Anki flashcard and this is what happens. Give the mechanism an indication of a Doncitron. A Doncitron? What's that? A 5-HT3 receptor antagonist. Motion sickness. Chemo induced. Then I try to make up some weird mnemonic that I also won't remember. Odontotron has three O's. 5-HT3 has a three. And if you combine motion and chemo, you also end up with three O's. Will I remember that? No, no, no. So as I was studying yesterday, I just kind of came across questions as well as made up things that I thought would have been good questions for the test, and today I'm just going to review those. So just finished the FOSS final exam. Um, I think it was alright. There were some really easy questions, and then there were questions that were like, I don't even remember like reading this or hearing these words. They were like very detailed questions about some of the pre-readings. So, eh, oh well. Craziest part was though that the lecture theater was so hot. Last time I was there, it was freezing cold. So this time I was like, okay, I'm prepared. I wore like shorts and then I wore fleece pants over top. I wore like six sweaters and layers and like a woolly cardigan and my down vest. I was ready to go. And then it was like the tropics in there. So that was rough, but what can you do? Anyways, I'm gonna go to Starbucks, study, just grind out a bunch of stuff for tomorrow. So I just spent the last five-ish hours at Starbucks. I'm using every bone in my body to not lie down in my bed. Uh, maybe just a foot. Oh, it's so comfy. Maybe just a hand. Oh, it's so soft. Maybe just my head. Uh. No, I must be strong. Just made dinner and I'm heading out to the beanery. Mostly because the beanery doesn't have any beds, so hopefully there's no temptation to just lie down and sleep. So I'm back home and it's my favorite time of day, uh, aka bedtime. Um, yeah, so I've just been sort of thinking about this exam prep and I'm actually quite pleased with myself. Not so much because I like studied super hard, but I think I've maintained like a really sane lifestyle. All right, so I'm back home now and I'm in bed. <laughs> Hopefully I get a little bit more work done while I'm in bed. Yeah, tomorrow's the last exam. I can't wait to be done. <laughs> so I went through and I had these dissection pictures that I labeled and I just basically made this worksheet for myself a while back and I'm going through and reviewing all of these structures for the anatomy lab tomorrow. I've gone through and highlighted all the things that I seem to keep forgetting Unfortunately, there is a lot of highlighted stuff. <sighs> Good morning. Today's the day of my last exam. Oh, I'm so excited. 
I'm also so tired. I had a master plan to sleep in till about, ooh, excuse me, 6 30 today, but my body had other plans. And I woke up at 3 30 in the morning and was wide awake. Um, and then luckily was able to fall back asleep. But it's like 5 45, a little earlier than I wanted to get up. But I guess this means more review time before my exam, which I need to be there to register at 7.30. Alrighty, so exams are done, woo! And we're filming the med school admissions music video. Uh, yeah, and then just hanging out for the rest of the day. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this rather lengthy vlog. And if you are a fellow student who has a bit of a winter break, please enjoy your break and take all the time off and relaxation time that you need. I'll be back in the new year with more med school vlogs. Bye for now.